a twilight moth by Madison Julius K. Wine all day the primroses have thought of thee, their golden heads close harem from the heat. All day the mystic moonflowers silkenly veiled snowy faces, that no bee might greet or butterfly that, weighed with pollen, passed, keeping sultana charms for thee, at last, their lord, who comest to salute each sweet. Cool-throated flowers that avoid the day's too fervid kisses. Every bud that drinks the tipsy dew into the starlight plays nocturnes of fragrance, thy winged shadow links in bonds of secret brotherhood and faith. O bearer of their order's shibboleth, like some pale symbol fluttering o'er these pinks. What dost thou whisper in the balsams? Ear that sets it blushing, or the hollyhocks, a syllabled silence that no man may hear, is dreamily upon its stem it rocks? What spell dost bear from listening plant to plant, like some white witch, some ghostly ministrant, some spectre of some perished flower of flocks? O voyager of that universe which lies between the four walls of this garden! Fair, whose constellations are the fireflies that wheel their instant courses everywhere, mid fairy firmaments wherein one sees mimic Boötes in the Pleiades, thou steerest like some fairy ship of air. Gnome rod of moonbeam fluff and gossamer, silent is sent, perhaps thou chariotest Mab or King Oberon, or, haply, her his queen. Titania, on some midnight quest. Oh for the herb, the magic Euphrasy that should unmask thee to mine eyes, ah me, and all that world at which my soul hath guessed.